There we go. Just talk about how the uh, the effectiveness of the run game and how it really helped in in all phases. No, I thought I thought we ran the ball really effectively. Uh, those guys up front did a tremendous job today, and, and the running backs did a great job of you know, finding those holes and, and making big plays. And um, you know, I think it opened up the rest of our rest of our game plan. I thought I thought our guys did really good today. Sure. Coach talked about how difficult the week was in terms of negativity and, and all that. Uh, how hard was that to deal with? You know, anytime you you face some adversity, there's going to be all sorts of noise, you know, around you. But you know, everybody in, in that locker room, uh, team wise, staff wise, supports that. Everybody, we just blocked out the noise. You know, e you know, every day, you know, all week. Uh, you know, it, it's tough bouncing back from from that kind of adversity. But our guys, we stuck together and we got we got it done today. How does it prepare you for the momentum needed for the final uh, four games of the season? Oh, it's it's huge. Anytime you can go into a a bye week uh, like like this next week with some momentum, uh, you can really assess everything you know prior, and uh, really get ready for that for that four game stretch. Jerry, the third quarter has been a nightmare for you guys this year. How good did it feel to have a third quarter like that? Oh, it was it was huge. You know, we we emphasize at halftime coming out uh, strong and and getting getting a touchdown uh, at the start of the second half, and then we did that, and from that moment on, we just kind of found our rhythm and, and played really well. Whitlow is just playing its guts out, isn't he? To talk talk about the performance you're getting from him. Yeah, Booby, he's he's a he's a good good kid. He uh, obviously very effective today, um, but you got to get got to give it to those guys uh, up front. They did a tremendous job of of opening up those holes for him, and he was you know big big playmaker for us today. When you run the football the way that you did, could you get a sense that everybody was feeling a certain way and confidence were building up as the game wore on? Yeah, sure. It, it definitely gives you confidence, uh, confidence to just kind of impose your will a little bit on on the. The uh, opposing team, and I thought I thought up front those guys did that, and they uh, they battled their butts off you know all day today, and like I said, those running backs did really good finding those holes. Jared, there were a few drops today. Um, that's a quarterback. Uh, how, do you, how do you deal with that? Keep throwing it to him. <laughs> uh, I mean, shoot or shoot. You know what I mean. So uh, I'm gonna keep throwing, and they're gonna keep catching, and that, that's how that's how I look at it. And I, I know that's how they look at it. I'm gonna keep coming back to back to those guys. I got. Full confidence in, in my teammates, and um, you know we're gonna we'll, we'll get it straight. You got your biggest games ahead of you. Does it kind of feel like this could be a turning point for the season? For sure, I, I definitely think anytime you can get momentum going into an off week, uh, we, especially with this four game stretch that we have here in November, um, you know it's it's going to be really really big for us. Uh, this off week is going to be key for us to get continue that momentum and, and get into Texas A&M. Sure. Was it a conscious effort to get Seth the ball? I guess I can pass it. For sure, I, I definitely think uh, Seth is a, is a huge playmaker um, for us, and we've, we've kind of learned his strengths throughout the year. And uh, he, he's a freak. He's going to be really, really good here. Um, so I'm just trying to get him the ball, let him, let him do, let him do his thing. Booby was able to get big chunk yardage, 170 yards on by himself on the ground. How big is that for the passing game to have a guy be able to dominate? Did you see it all open up? Yeah, I, I definitely thought you know his run game uh, with those guys up front with Booby and Sean. Cam, Malik Miller, I mean, all those guys, they really opened up the game play. And, uh, you know, whenever we can run the ball effectively like that, you know, it, like I said, it kind of opens up. Is this kind of what you envisioned this offense could be this year, balanced both ways, no turnovers? Oh, 100%. I mean, this is what we're capable of. Um, it was just a matter of going out there and doing it. I mean, that's all it, all it comes down to. Is it frustrating that it did take eight games to have this performance? I mean, ideally, I mean, you, you want it to hit, you know, game one. But, you know, every season's got, got its struggles. Um, you know, every season you're going to go through some some type of adversity, and you know today it was just really it was really good to see everybody come together this week, uh, especially with the last two weeks, just come together, be a team, and get and get a win. You may have already been asked, but what was said at halftime, and, and obviously the third quarter you guys came out kind of on fire. But what was said at halftime, and, and what you guys, what was the motivation there in third quarter? You know, everybody was uh, everybody was feeling really good. Um, we emphasized, you know, coming out the second half, that first drive, getting a touchdown. And uh, sure enough, we were able to, to run the ball effectively in the second half, throw it effectively in the second half. Excuse me. And uh, I thought I thought we did a really really good job of finding that rhythm. And, and Booby Willow, I know obviously got hurt, but I mean just talk about what he did on the field before he got hurt, and, and you know 170 yards rushing something like that. How, how good was he today? He was awesome. Um, as awesome as he was, you got to give it to those guys up front. Those guys up front played their best game today. Um, run game, pass game, they they played really really well. Super proud of those guys and. Super proud of, uh, of the rest of the guys, too.